G'day, it's Rob here again. Well, I'm just doing a short video today to uh, do a couple of shout outs to people who've uh, helped me out a bit lately, or offered to help me out. And uh, I've been meaning to do this for a while, but it just hasn't fitted, fitted in with the, uh, the videos I've been doing. Uh, first one is to uh, Craig Root from uh, USA, uh, Oklahoma, I think, pretty sure. And uh, yeah, Craig's a nice guy, he sent me across at a considerable expense, uh, a vacuum tube to use on Stirling engines. And Craig's channel is uh, to do with Stirling engines. He's just getting started on it, so he's got a way to go, but he's the Stirling engine man for sure. He knows a lot about it, and he's made a lot of big scale ones, you know, large scale engines. I'm interested to see how that channel goes. And I always like to support small channels. I mean, well, my channel's not a big channel, but we all start at the beginning and we all progress. And yeah, I subscribe to a lot of channels that are just uh, small ones, you know, because you always get good community involvement. You always get good comments and you always get uh, uh, <laughs> uh, out of the normal ways of doing things at times, which can be quite rewarding and, and, and interesting. Now, so thanks, Craig. I really appreciated that. Uh, I'd ask that people don't send me stuff really in the future because it's just so, too expensive to ship, you know, these days. And particularly from the USA, uh, the cost of shipping stuff is terrible. So but thanks a lot. I really appreciate that. Uh, the other shout out is, is, shout out is to uh, JB from Oz. Uh, he's a guy uh, in Australia, obviously. And yeah, JB offered to cut me a, laser cut me a, a new protective um, piece of uh, perspex for that uh, digital micrometer that, that got hit by that flying piece of steel and uh, you know I didn't take him up on that but it was a good offer and you know thanks a lot JB and once again JB from Oz is setting up a channel he's got a channel going and he's growing and uh, he wants to get to that thousand mark that thousand um, subscriber mark so yeah help him out too um, I'll put his link in the uh, description as well so there are the two shout outs I've been meaning to do and uh, yeah, it was worrying me that I hadn't done it. I like to thank people uh, who helped me. Now, state of the play, well, it's almost like a state of, of the union address, I suppose, this one. It's uh, what's happening with the channel, my channel, and all the other channels around, all these product reviews. Why is it going on? Well, there's a product review war going on at the moment, if you haven't guessed, between uh, three or four major uh, players, store, stores or storefronts. And you basically got Banggood, which is a store. You've got um, uh, AliExpress, which is a front end for a whole bunch of stores. Uh, you've got uh, Gearbest. Gearbest, yeah, I think that's it. And that's also another uh, store. And there's a couple of others as well. I've been contacted by three of them and I'm only doing Banggood reviews at the moment, and I'm only doing them because I find them interesting. I look at these products and think, gee, I wonder what that's like, you know, but I wouldn't go out and spend my hard cash because that's pretty limited. Uh, I do everything on a shoestring, unless I was sure that the product was going to be good. So it's, I think it's good to do these reviews and see these reviews and, you know, see if this stuff is up to scratch. And if it is up to scratch, spread the word. So anyway, what I've done so far is um, just stuff that I you know, would like to have in my shop and think about it. And, you know, if it's worth it, well, then, yeah, I'd go and buy it. So what do I get out of it? Well, all I get out of it is a free object, a free product, a free tool. I don't get any money for doing this, except from any advertising that comes from the normal YouTube advertising, which is what most small channels like to have a bit of income from it pays the bills you know keeps the isp uh, going and even buys a bit of beer so yeah uh in my situation i get a free product that's it and if you click on those links in the review uh, description nah i get nothing for that and i don't get paid anything for doing the video even though i could charge for it i mean but at the moment it's not a cash cow, this, this is just a channel, it's a hobby, and uh, that's all I do it for, just community, give back to the community, and uh, yeah, interest. 
So that's it. Uh, what other channels do, I can't say, but that's the situation with me. And yes, I mean, it's amazed me that for a long time I've thought, well, why don't these uh, stores support our, our little channels like us? Because it's just a, it's just a, you know, a golden opportunity to um, promote your product. You know, at virtually no no cost to them. And now they've uh, they've woken up and they're all starting to compete for it. And I will say that of the channels, uh, the only one that I think is <laughs> reliable as far as the reviews go at the moment are the two, basically the two storefront, uh, the, the two shops uh, like Banggood and Gearbest because uh, in the case of Ge uh, Banggood, they don't review any of the videos that go up. They don't have any input whatsoever as to what is in that video, whether that video is going to can the product or whatever. They don't see see the video. They have no influence whatsoever. Whereas the other major player, uh, AliExpress, all videos have to be reviewed to, short, to make sure that they um, are satisfactory, shall we say, um, that uh, the product gets a glowing review. So I don't expect to see any negative reviews on some of those other... Uh, storefront um, websites, shall we say. That's the way I read it anyway. That's my personal opinion. But in the case of Banggood, yep, anything goes. And uh, yep, as you've seen on some of the reviews from other channels, there's some dodgy stuff there, but there's some damn good stuff too. And it's and some great value for money stuff. And when you look at the, the cash you're laying out and what you get, yeah, it's hard to go past some of that stuff. Certainly if you're uh, just a, a hobby do-it-yourselfer like, uh, like I am. Anyway, that's all I've got to say on the matter. I just thought I'd uh, bang this out, give you a bit of a lowdown on what's happening. Uh, I'll probably do a few more reviews down the path. I've had a few people complain, moaning that, oh, you know, it's turning into a review channel. But, well, if you want to get this stuff and play with it, you've got to do these things. And if they're not happy watching reviews, well... Bugger off and go and watch another channel. <laughs> okay, that's it for me. And uh, yeah, till next time. Cheers.